And we want to get back to that breaking news now in North Miami. Right now, police are investigating the possible drownings of two young children. And as we said at the top of the show, the one and two-year-olds have been rushed to Jackson Memorial Hospital. Now we can go out to CBS 4's Tiani Jones was there live. Tiani. Those two children were brought here unresponsive. They are now in the trauma unit in critical condition. Now, here's what I've been able to find out. Police tell us that a family member actually found them, the kids, who are a boy and a girl, in the pool and pulled them out. When they were pulled out, like I said, they were unresponsive, and family members immediately called 911 and began performing CPR. Police say it's uncertain at this time if the kids actually lived in the home. We only know that family lives there. Right now, investigators are simply trying to figure out how the kids ended up in the pool while trying to provide some type of comfort to the family. This is always very difficult for police and for fire when they respond to something like this because we always associate it with our own personal uh, families and uh, we always have a difficult time but we try to do our best and we try to support the family the best that we can. Again, the latest information that we've been able to receive from police that the one and two year olds, a girl and a boy are in critical condition. Reporting live from Jackson Memorial, Tiani Jones, CBS 4 News tonight. Tiani, thank you.